So when I pull up to a ship on a sloop, I like to use the bottom of my sail and the top of my birds as a marker. If you look straight ahead, you can see the birds on the bottom of my sail. Now as I get closer, I will raise the bottom of the sail to the top of the birds. And continue to do that until I am on top of the shipwreck. So now my birds are getting covered, just getting covered. But we got a little bit more to go. So as long as you can see the birds clearly, we could leave the sails down. But as soon as the birds start getting covered by the bottom of the sail is when you want to start raising the bottom of your sail up. So like now, the birds are getting harder to see. the birds are covered. So now is when you want to start raising the sail. Now you keep your eye on the birds in the sail, keeping them at the bottom of the sail. Now when you're in calm waters, you know you are at the shipwreck and you can finish raising your sail. If you are coming in too hot, all you really have to do is turn the wheel to your right or to your left to bring you in closer. And if you are really coming in hard, just leave your wheel pinned to one side or the other and just spin around in your circle. <clears throat> So you have the proper way you want to be pointing the ship and then swim down and get your chest. <laughs> Message in a bottle. Treasury of the Lost Agents. Kind of hoping it was a... Oh no. Treasury. Nice. I'll take a treasure. Right. Shrine of Ancient Tears. Tribute. Treasury of the Lost Agents is back west of us. I'll show you how to pull up to a... Shrine slash treasury west by northwest. Back to my channel, Piranha 10 Gaming. In this episode, we will be docking a sloop over at a shipwreck, treasury, shrine, same thing, and over at Plunder Valley and Island. Um, if you're not following me on Twitch, I stream every Saturday at 7, so head on over there, Piranha 10 TV. Uh, if you're not subscribed here yet, make sure you do so. You can hit that little notification bell. Helps me out a lot. And also, make sure you join my Discord because there I will be announcing my new channel, Piranha 10's Auto Show. So if you're interested in cars and how they work and working on them and you know, just want to check it out, my Discord is going to be the first to know. So without further ado, we'll get you back to the show. Peace. <laughs> So when you're pulling up to the shrine or treasury, 
get your heading. Get it on your horizon. Heading is northwest, so we're a little off course here. Now docking at a shrine or treasury. Get your heading. And there you go. Now you see its remnants there. Just wait until it gets brighter to you. Bigger. Now, when you're just about close enough to get into the circle, pull up your sail. And turn your wheel all the way to one side. Should push us back into the circle. You have to give yourself a little sail, straighten out. And that will put you in your circle which supposedly if you're in the circle rogue skeleton ships will not attack you again let's pick our spot it is looks like a nice beachy area which is going to be the east side of the island we are going to come in from the southwest side sail and we're off again. Now that you get your title screen, <clears throat> you want to head out to one side and then start cutting towards the island. Plus, we call wind on this one. So you want to abandon the wheel, pick up your sail. Now, if you came in a little too hot, that's okay, because you can always use your harpoon to slow you down. <clears throat> and even stop you at the beach. 
I never drop my anchor. All right, guys. Now that's how you devour docking. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed that little bit of a docking experience. Started docking some islands, reefers, sea forts, shrines, shipwrecks, outposts, and seaports. Um, let me know what you all think uh, over here on Twitch. Send me a whisper, give me a follow. Join my Discord. You can hit me up there. And on YouTube, subscribe, comment, and share. You can let me know what you want to see in future videos. Again, hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll catch you on the seas. Peace. Yeah.